So I'm currently installing the wiring for my grid charger for my Prius. So this one basically you have to open the uh, the uh, the battery pack uh, this side only, and I'm going to install the positive terminal on this one. Yep, a positive. Then put the bolt back in. Now I'm doing the. I already got the positive side. I'm going to do the negative side. These are really tight bolt. So now time to tighten this bolt. I already got the negative side installed. Get the clips back in. And we'll reroute this here. Yep. So, yep, this is the end of the cable. So we're gonna put the cable back. Okay, the current voltage of my battery right now is 220 volts. And I'm going to charge it, plug in the unit. Okay, I got the unit plugged in and we'll see in the next few hours if that voltage rises. So it's going to slowly charge it. It's not like a fast charge. So we'll see how this uh, grid charger works. Okay, so after one hour of charging, my voltage is up to 230. So we'll try again in the next hour, see how how high it will so go. So after two hours and 30 minutes, it's right around 233 volts now. Okay, so after four hours, the uh, the battery voltage went down to 229 so oh, what it means is that the uh, the battery charging has lits, has reached its limits and it's actually warming up the battery so uh, when this happens uh, it's pretty much time to um, turn it off and then let it cool down and then do the process again So I'm going to turn it off. Then okay, it. let's try start this uh, this Prius after uh, grid charging. See if there's a difference. Okay. I lost my AM FM. Battery is uh, six bars. One two. Or five bars. Oh, it didn't uh, ready start yet. Ready mode. Motor should kick in. Okay, so you got the uh, so the charge went down. Huh. Looks like it didn't work. Yep. Yep. Charging it didn't work. So the grid charging didn't uh, fix my, uh, yep, it still has that problem.
Okay, we'll turn it off. Um, there's no point. Well, great charger didn't revive the bad cells. So, I'm not expecting that, but I'm hoping that there's a miracle. But, uh, yeah, this is how it looks now. So I got all the bolts taken out. It's just a matter of pulling that uh, terminal out and then removing the bolts there and then time to remove that bad cell and then uh, do the uh, charging again. Hopefully it works. So removing the cover and this is how the battery looks like. So block 7 is this one. One, two, three. One, five, six, seven. So it's pretty much the center. Center of the pack. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So note that this is positive, negative, positive, negative. And this is where the vent hose connects. And this is where the temperature sensor is. Okay, I got all the cells out, I mean the modules out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the center cells outside. And then the outside cells on the middle. So I'm gonna rotate the process of getting the bus bars, the couple of bus bars. So this color you just uh, press on this tab, and then uh, hold up. Soak this all this into the vinegar. Soaking the bus bars into the vinegar. It's gonna take a okay, while. So this module is bad. It's only 6.48 volts. Same thing with the other one. Well the rest of my uh, cells here or my modules here are 7.74, 7.75 volts. Yeah, all of them. Except for those two. So I got the bus bars cleaned. They're not corroded now. Yeah, it's really tough to polish them, but um, they just made sure that um, uh, the corrosion is not there anymore. So I'm just going to reconnect the nuts. Did I just flash my Two hours and a half of charging. So no changes for the last 15 minutes. So this is the maximum voltage. So I'm gonna turn off the charger. Yeah, I'm going to service the uh, the fan before uh, I put it in. See all those dust in here. So I got the uh, the what they call this the vent plastic. And the uh, the fan is actually clean, so I don't need to take that out. I'm gonna clean this. Uh, there's like some filters going on here. Well, this thing is really heavy. Uh, you need at least like two person to do it, but I'm all alone now. So everything here there is in place with the safety cardboard box in here. Okay, I got all the stuff there assembled. I just didn't put on the seat yet. Just gonna test it out, see if it works. So the moment of truth. Okay.
ready mode. My battery is full. Well, it's like six bars. And I need to turn on the AC. Uh, I'll do it auto. So far, no check engine light. And the engine is running. Oh, problem. Oh, no. a problem showing up uh oh oh no this connection failed oh no didn't work oh damn triangle still there oh shoot with all those work to see what's going on well everything seems to be normal including the hybrid battery yep normal no DTC so I'm gonna clear it see what's going on the only DTC there is the air conditioning which is for the solar stuff so, okay. Okay, now the uh, triangle is gone, or maybe it's just uh, like a fluke. Uh oh. That's weird. Diagnose here. Yeah. It's still showing up the triangle. Okay, we'll see the live data here. Diagnose. Oh. Where's my key? Text me. It's there. Got the voltage here, 15.16 volts. Or 15, 15. So what's the minimum voltage? Battery state of charge is 49.5%. Yeah, they're all 15 volts. Okay. Yeah, I don't see anything lower. They're all 15. Uh oh, there's one. There's one that goes down to 14. And I don't hear the fan actually running. So it goes. Okay, I'm driving it around. And it's still blinking. 
somehow I think the X2 doesn't uh, wasn't able to detect the code. Yeah. There's still a flow of charging and discharging. Now I got it all to green. Yep, it's fully charged, but. Battery is fully charged. Let me see the uh, triangle of death. Still not showing, but I think it will still show up. So what I'm going to do is just basically drive it around, see if it changes things. So day two of testing. We'll see if we still have the triangle of death thing. Starts. No triangle. AC is blowing. And it's charging. Engine started. And I'm gonna drive. I think I'm just gonna drive it across the block. Normally at this point, I get the triangle of death somehow, but it hasn't appeared yet. So the battery is now two bars quickly. charging I'm trying to do a coasting now so that uh, the battery will get recharged again same as before where it's struggling it's pretty much normal so far it's been quiet well I'm back home and uh, no red triangle showing up and I'm on like uh, one two three four probably six bars now Yep, so, so far looking good, hopefully.